You know when you need a button click to scroll further down the same page like this? It's called an anchor link. And in this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to do it in Bricks. I'm Dave Foy, and this is the first in an occasional series of quick Bricks tips for Bricks beginners. Those little things in Bricks that are only blindingly obvious once you know how. If this is helpful, give us a like and subscribe for more Bricks content. First job, go into Bricks settings and just make sure that you've enabled smooth scroll. Once that's done, let's go edit the page with Bricks. Yep, it's this boring old sales page. So this button here is at the very top of the sales page for what looks like a very dull course. <sighs> and over in the settings, here's where we're going to add the link. And because it's on the same page, the link is going to be the ID of the section we want to scroll to. So that is this section right down here, the buy section. So I'll make sure that section's selected. You grab the ID of the section top left up here, just hover and copy element ID. Briggs automatically gives every element a unique ID. Always very catchy. You could rename this ID to something more meaningful to you if you like, but there's no need really. By the way, if you have a class applied to the section for styling like I have here, make sure that you're not actively styling it. If you are, just click the X to clear it so that you can grab the ID. Now we need to set this ID as the link in the button back up at the top. So I'll come over to the structure and select the first section again to whiz back up to the button. Select the button again. Over to the link for this button. We actually want external URL here. I know, bit weird, because this URL is the exact opposite of external, right? Anyway, external just allows us to paste in whatever we like. So just paste the ID of the section here. Nice and easy. Now I'll come and save this page. It's quicker if you just Command S or Control S, depending on if you're on a Mac or a PC. Now let's give it a test. Come up into preview. Now anchor links don't work directly in preview mode though. So we need to view on the front end to see the real live page. Click the button, whizzes down, and that's it. Easy. I hope that was helpful. If you want to see how Bricks can really level up your workflow, I have a free on-demand Bricks masterclass running right now. I'll drop a link below this video so that you can jump in and check it out. And if you have any suggestions for other quick Bricks tips like this, drop them in a comment below. I'd love to hear them, and I'll see you soon.